Carrie Underwood feels she looks different after scary accident, says radio host Bobby Bones. Months after Carrie Underwood suffered a scary fall during which she broke her wrist and had to get 40 stitches in her face, radio host Bobby Bones, whom Carrie first spoke to about her fall, is opening up about the singer's incident. I think, in her mind, it was a pretty bad injury that took a while to come back from. He told People in a new interview. I think she feels that she looks different because she wrote that in her letter to the fans especially early on. She said, I may not look the same. And she had reconstruction on her face but she looks wonderful. I don't know that I would have even noticed it, Bobby added. In April, the 35-year-old singer chronicled the details of her accident on the Bobby Bones show. Carrie's awesome. I told her when she came in that I expected this crazy facial difference in her and had she not said something about it I just don't think I would have noticed, Bobby said of their sit-down. She said she puts a lot of makeup on but again I was sitting three feet from her and there really wasn't anything crazy. Two months ago, around the same time as her interview with Bobby, Carrie also updated her fans on her health taunt teased her new look. First off, physically, I'm doing pretty darn good these days. My wrist is almost back to normal. About 90% there. And the doctors say that last 10% will come in time, Carrie wrote on her official website at the time. And my face has been healing pretty nicely as well. I definitely feel more like myself than I have in a while. One of the silver linings for me in this healing process is the time I've gotten to spend with, my husband, Mike and, son, Isaiah. She continued, I've been calling it forced relaxation. Sometimes I think things happen in order to make us slow down. That same day, Carrie took to her social media accounts to tease her first new single, album, and performance since suffering her injuries. I've been in the studio writing and singing a ton, but I've also been able to be creative in a way that I've never been before, which has been very fulfilling and empowering. She explained on her website, I've always been lucky to have a voice in the writing and recording process, but this is the first time I am this involved in the production of my music. It's been challenging and incredibly rewarding to be involved in every aspect from start to finish. The mom of one then proceeded to share details about her new single, which was previously released on Wednesday, April 11th. The first single is a song I love so much and can't wait to share with you. It's called Cry Pretty. She wrote, the title refers to when emotions take over and you just can't hold them back. It really speaks to a lot of things that have happened in the past year and I hope when you hear it, you can relate those feelings to those times in your life. It's emotional. It's real. And it rocks. We agree. Though Carrie refrained from sharing post-accident photos of herself on social media before her music release, the singer just surprisingly took to Instagram on April 6 to share the first full-face image of her new look with her 7 million followers. Missed these guys. Hashtag band rehearsals. Carrie captioned the pic of herself singing on stage. Carrie similarly shared a black and white snapshot with only one side of her face visible via Instagram on April 4. She didn't caption the photo. But the image clearly showed the star sitting in a recording studio, working on her new music. After she posted the pic, the Smoke Break songstress fans couldn't help but mention how great she looks in the pic's comments section. Just as beautiful as the last time we saw you, one person wrote with another similarly adding, still looking as perfect as ever. Before that, on February 23, Carrie took to Instagram to post a pic of herself and her husband, Mike Fisher, promoting the End It movement which works to bring awareness to modern-day slavery. Together, we're in it to end it. Help us shine a light on modern-day slavery. The star captioned the black and white snapshot which only showed part of her face. In mid-December 2017, the American Idol alum made major headlines when the very first pic emerged online of Carrie after her injury. Reality star Adrienne Gang posted a snapshot of herself posing with Carrie after they ran into each other at the gym with the caption, just worked out next to Carrie Underwood. No big deal. Hashtag chef life hashtag below deck hashtag love my job. Shortly after Carrie announced she had been badly injured outside her Nashville home in early November 2017, the mom of one revealed she had been doing great since undergoing surgery for a broken wrist. Her rep later told People that Carrie suffered multiple injuries during the incident and was additionally treated for cuts and abrasions. Carrie subsequently took to Twitter to thank her fans for their messages. Thanks so much for all the well wishes everybody.
I'll be all right. Might just take some time, she wrote. Then in early January, Carrie made headlines again when she posted a candid blog post on her website warning fans she might look a bit different after her injury. There is also another part of the story that I haven't been ready to talk about since I have still been living it and there has been much uncertainty as to how things will end up. It's crazy how a freak random accident can change your life. In addition to breaking my wrist, I somehow managed to injure my face as well, she wrote. When I am ready to get in front of a camera. I want you all to understand why I might look a bit different," she continued. I'm hoping that, by then, the differences are minimal, but, again, I just don't know how it's all going to end up. After Adrienne posted the first post-injury photo of Carrie to her social media accounts, the reality star told commenters the country icon looked amazing and she had no clue she was even hurt. Carrie's fans were also a bit confused as to why Carrie seemingly looked uninjured in the pic. Her face doesn't look any different, right? One person wrote. Another fan pointed out that she did appear to be wearing a wrist brace in the snapshot. Other people commented on possible differences in her face and made speculations about the extent of Carrie's accident. I think it's her right cheek if, you're, Looking at her, if you look at the picture, you can see what appears to be redness by her nose down into her face. I hope she recovers quickly. One fan wrote with another adding, I am surprised she was willing to take a pic and didn't say no I just had accident. And why won't Carrie just say exactly what happened? It was over a month ago. I understand at first you may be traumatized but we now know something happened. Just say it. We're so glad Carrie is back in the spotlight since the incident with all her recent photos and performances. We missed her.